Hey everyone, in today's video, I will be explaining how to set up and use universal gestures on your Samsung Galaxy Watch 6. These gesture settings help you operate the Watch 6 more conveniently without repeatedly touching the screen. For example, if you are getting an incoming call on your watch, you can pick it up without touching the screen. Let's begin the process of activating gestures. Go to the menu and open settings. Tap on accessibility, then find and tap on interaction and dexterity. Next, tap on universal gestures and toggle the button to turn it on. Now, customize your gestures according to your preferences by tapping on gesture. Here you will find different types of gestures like pinch, double pinch, make fist and make fist twice. First, tap on the gesture guide to understand how each gesture works. You can see on my screen how the watch gesture guide demonstrates all the gestures. Take your time to understand these gestures. Next, let's add actions to the gestures. Begin with the pinch gesture. Choose an action. I will select tap for the pinch option. For double pinch, I will choose the next item. For make fist and make fist twice gestures, I am going to select the previous item and action menu respectively. The action menu includes various actions such as swipe up, swipe down, swipe left, swipe right, apps button, notifications, styles, open quick panel, edit watch face, go to the previous screen, exit action menu, etc. Now it's time to activate the gestures. Return to the universal gestures page and tap on the activation gesture. You will have the option to auto-activate gestures when the screen is on. If you don't want to use the gesture feature all the time, then don't worry. There are three more options to activate gestures instantly. Shake gesture, nod gesture, knock-knock gesture. You can use only one type of activation gesture at a time. Let's understand one by one. Start with the shake gesture and practice it from the gesture tutorial. Tap on gestures tutorials, then shake gesture. The tutorial will guide you to rotate your wrist from side to side twice. Let's try it. Wow, it's working. Do it one more time. I will select this to activate my gestures. Now tap on the nod gesture. For this, you need to shake your arm twice, bending at the elbow. You can see how I am doing it. Lastly, the knock knock gesture. Tap on it, here you need to make a knocking motion. Do it with your wrist as I am demonstrating on the screen. Now, you are all set to control your watch with the help of gestures. Let's do some tests to check its performance. First, press the home button to wake up the watch and activate the gestures feature using the shake gesture. Here, I am receiving a call. I will accept the call using the gesture. For this, I need to do a pinch two times. Wow, this is looking cool. After conducting these tests, I have found that universal gestures can be a great tool for performing simple tasks, especially when you can't use both hands. That's all I wanted to share in today's video. If you found this information helpful, then please hit the like button and subscribe to Wearholic to get regular updates on smartwatches. Thanks for watching this video.